think there's any way. If I did get them closed, you wouldn't want to be sitting across the table from me. <laughs> you know? Hey you, welcome or welcome back to The Flow Show with your curvy girl, Flo. My channel is all about looking fierce, staying frugal, and feeling absolutely fabulous at any size. So if those are all things that sound good to you, then I would suggest clicking the subscribe button. Or don't. Do whatever you want. It's your life. Today, I am trying on some clothes that I got from Giant Tiger. Giant Tiger is kind of like, like cheaper Walmart, if that's possible. I've done like a little try on, what did I do it for? Oh, one of my um, pairs of leather leggings in my leather legging comparison video, they were from there and they were bad. They weren't good. So basically what I'm saying is they're not necessarily known for their Quality. It has more star quality. Mary Gilbo. That's right. G U I L B E A U X. But when I was there, I just like popped in. I bought a few plants, a few groceries. They have everything. It's like a Walmart, but like an eighth of the size. It's great. So they do have some clothes, and I spined this like perfect skirt. I'm doing a leather lookbook soon, and I saw this skirt, and like there was all kinds of other things that I saw that were amazing, and I thought, you know what? Why don't I do a little bit of a haul? And something that's great about Giant Tiger is that you have like an unlimited time, like not even a year, like unlimited time as long as you have the receipt. And like, it's not like totally worn. So I was like, bonus, no rush. Although I do want to get that money back in my bank account if I don't need these things. Cause you know me, frugal. So, would love that money back. <laughs> so today I got six things that I'm going to be trying on. I think I got three pairs of pants and a skirt and a dress and a shirt. So I'm gonna do a try on, see what I like, see what's good. Well, let's just start trying on because why am I still talking? <laughs> okay, so the first piece that I got is this leopard print top. It was, it was $7. Obviously it's a leopard print, my favorite print of all time. Duh. What I love about this is that this style is very in right now, like almost like a peasant, peasant blouse. I'm pretty sure that <laughs> sounds so bad. Bloody peasant. Kind of like a peasant style blouse. I don't know what you call this. Flounce. I don't know. But it has this like fully elasticized top. So it's very stretchy. This is an extra large. I probably could have sized down, but I think it was the last one. This, like the empire waist and then a little poof is not usually my favorite look, but I actually don't hate it on this because the elasticized part goes like down to my most cinched part. So like, I'm not mad at it, but I also feel like this is a shirt that I would be really happy to like sew or like tuck it into my bra. So it was a crop top. You know me. I need like a shirt that just says, you know me. It'll be my like first merch drop. <laughs> so cute as a little crop. And it, since it's elasticized, it will just stay. Hopefully. Like so cute. I think I like it way more like that, but for like real life practicality slash fall winter, which is coming up. I honestly love fall fashion. As much as I've been complaining about the summer ending, I love summer. I love like just throwing something on. I love getting a tan and then my makeup looks like even better. But I do love fall fashion. Like fall fashion, can't deny. It's too good. I like these colors for fall and I like that it's a different, like it's not just like a normal cheetah print. It's a black background with brown cheetah print spots. And some like white ones too. I don't know, it's cute. Will I keep it? I don't know. For $7, like that's twice as much as I pay for my Frenchies shirts. So I just don't know if it's worth it to me. It's a great deal still. I'm just unreasonably cheap. So to keep or not to keep, that is the question. Let me know. Also, let's just see. This way, 
versus this sweater. I feel like I can't edit that together, so why did I do that? <laughs> The next thing I got is a little summer sundress. It says that it's 14, but I'm pretty sure on my receipt it was $10. So bonus, if you like something, take it up to the cash. You never know if it's gonna be on sale. And if you don't want it, don't get it. No pressure. Also, this is a size small. As I always say, there's nothing about me that's small. So the material to this, I tried it in the store. I didn't try it on, but the material to this, I was like feeling it in the store and I was like, I feel like I could squeeze into this. So yeah, totally. So this is a size small. I always say, try everything on because you never know what's gonna fit you. And I'm glad I did because it's actually a very cute fit. Nice length too. It's not too short. It's actually like just above the knee. Size small. I love purple. Purple's a very cute color right now. Actually, almost a perfect match. Yeah, so like I always say, try everything on. You just never know what's gonna fit for you. I really like the cut of the bodice on this. This could be a really good dress. I was actually thinking I was gonna have to return this, but I like it. I'm such a huge fan of like a throw on whatever summer dress, so. I might have to keep this. I've had the same summer dresses for so long. Like, I feel like I just need to retire some of them. I also need a haircut. I feel like before my next video, I need to just like chop a bunch off and dye it. I could have dyed it for once in months. Um, let's talk about the dress. I like it. I'm keeping it. That's it. All right, next up is this cute faux leather skirt. I love the color of this. Normally not for me, not necessarily something that I would be like, ooh, need that. However, I think this is cute as hell. I just feel like the options to make cute, unique, fun outfits with this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, very cute. Love the color, love the fit. I have no idea what size this is. I wanna say it's an extra large. It's a large. It's a large and like, look how much room there is. Yes. I can like totally indulge in like a good meal <laughs> and still be able to sit, sit, still be able to sit, feel comfortable. I don't know, even with like, even with a belly, I still feel cute. Mm. Mm. Yeah, I love this. And this is definitely gonna be featured in my upcoming leather lookbook. Because I just feel like the outfits with this, like it's such a such an interesting color. Like I have an olive green skirt. Olive green is kind of my thing. Like this. I don't even know what to call this. Teal? I don't know, but whatever it is, it's freaking cute. This was the most expensive thing, actually. This was $18. Is it worth $18? That's the question. Like, yes, I invested $20 in the leather pencil skirt from my like Trash and Treasures haul. Um, gosh, I just don't know. Can you hear that music? Anyway, as usual, let me know what you think of this. Is it worth keeping for like 20 bucks? It's a little bit like lumpy bumpy, but whatever, I don't care. If you just like ruch it up. I'm also like dying to see this with like tights and everything in the winter. Cute. I also feel like if I keep the tag tucked in, I can like test it out and then return it if I don't want it. <laughs> Is that bad? Does that make me a bad person? Maybe. I was definitely not looking for anything like this, but when I was on Pinterest, literally all I can see is like, okay, maybe it's for young people, but like all I can see are young people wearing khaki pants and chocolate brown tops. And I was like, I would do a khaki pant if it was cute, but most of them are not on me. I just find with like a big, huge butt. <laughs> I don't love the way that khaki pants look on me. However, I just happened upon these ones and they have all these like pleats in them. Pleats are usually a good look for the upper waist. I just feel like they could be like almost like a business slash they give me um kind of like a Victorian explorer, like Jane from Tarzan. Do you know what I mean? Like that kind of look. And they're like a pantaloon, <laughs> like a pantaloon. Do you know what I mean? Like they're wide leg. 
what am I even talking about? Um, I don't know. So only $10. So yeah, the price tag jumped out at me first. <laughs> so let's see how they fit. Oh, oh no. Uh, not even close. <laughs> yeah, there's like no. <laughs> oh, no, yeah, I did get them. <laughs> yes. All right. Oh man, I was thinking that they were not gonna fit. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> what size are these? All right, they're a large. What was I expecting? I don't think there's any way. If I did get them closed, you wouldn't want to be sitting across the table from me. You know? So I'm gonna say that's a no. These are a no. Too bad, I feel like they could have been really cute. No. The next two pants that I got are actually, I'm really excited. These are the things that I'm the most excited to try on. They're like a, a fancy pant. Fancy pants. Fancy pants, but they're joggers. So they're in like fancy like business prints, but they're like sweatpants kind of. I love to be comfortable and I love to be fancy. The best of both worlds. You're the way my wild friend. Right? Best of both worlds. Okay, so let's just try them on. Oh, I already love these. They're already so like, oh, yay. Yes. I'm like fancy and comfortable. Everything I want. Perfect. Oh my God. They look good on the booty. They feel good on the booty. Even better. And they were $15. Not ridiculously cheap, but oh my God. These are amazing. I am in love. And they're only a size large and they're so like spacious. We love that. Okay, yeah, like I feel like I need these. I feel like these are gonna be so cute in the winter with like a good boot, good turtleneck look. Oh yeah. And I could even wear them as pajamas. I probably won't, but yeah, these are freaking cute. Freaking cute. Love that. Let me know what you think of those. The other pair are $17. <laughs> Break in the bank. But they're like this color scheme. Love that. So hopefully these are just as comfortable as these ones. Also in a size large, let's see. <laughs> Ooh, and these ones go all the way to the ground. So that's a bonus. As you might've noticed that the other ones don't, oh, please go over my butt. The other ones were like a, a capri length. Okay, yeah, we're good, we're good. All right, these ones are like slightly more grandma. As in like, I feel like my grandma owned these pants. Slightly less flattering in the pooch area. Well, they're not the worst. I feel like these are also gonna be fun to make like looks. I don't know if I like these ones as much as the other ones. I don't know, they're both very comfortable. These ones are not quite as stretchy, not quite as comfortable as the last ones, but they got pockets as well and they go all the way to the ground, so what to do? You gotta let me know which ones are better because I feel like I should only keep one. How many plaid pants, plaid joggers does a girl need, really? So let me know. I couldn't do it without you. Something I just noticed, like I feel like it might be possible that they're too small for me. These, they're pleated here and the pleats are like, going out instead of going in. So I feel like the problem is that they're just too small for me. So I might just have to return them. Anyway, that's it for my giant tiger try on. There were some wins, there were some like, no's. So I'm definitely gonna have to take some of those things back. But what's great is I have an unlimited time to do it, but I am gonna do it quickly. Like I said, get that money back in my account. <laughs> Let me know what items you liked the best and make sure that you're subscribed so that you don't miss out on my upcoming leather lookbook because I'm honestly so excited. I love faux leather and this skirt, like it's such a unique piece, such a unique color. So 
I'm excited to play with that. <laughs> anyway, as always, stay fierce, frugal, and fabulous. And we'll see you next time.